And then, uh, you know, mana regenerates to summon the Kyobi to no avail since Naruto has its seal. Then the fucker releases, releases the wood style Kuku Jutsu, wood style defecation Jutsu. Mara, motherfucker! I mean, fuck the heaven! <laughs> and that's how the shit ends, people! Woo! I gotta say, I gotta say, alright? I respect King of Lightning, but he said last week that he feels sorry for anime only viewers, but not at all, bro. They got their fucking treat today, and it was fucking sweet. This shit is gonna last them like the whole fucking year 2013. I mean, basically. Basicalmente. Learn, learn that Spanglish. And, you know, it also, it makes sense, you know, that Mana could be this strong. I mean, he survived and triumphed in an era where, you know, there was complete utter turmoil. There were no nations, just hundreds of fucking, fucking clans. They defending and fighting for themselves. They found the Senju, the strongest clan, multiple times, countless times. So he's strong and like these far off fucking ninjas. So it, it, it makes sense, you know, why he would just be able to just exercise on these fucking far off ninjas, right? So, now for my chapter review. The animation, 10 out of fucking 10. Perfect, 10 out of 10. The environment, battleground, 10 out of 10. 10, 10. That's right, my girl, 1010. I mean, did you see the, those clouds in the sky? Do you know what type of fucking clouds those are? Those are Cumulonimbus clouds. Those are my favorite clouds. Autostratus clouds. That's right, go to Google and image search an Autostratus cloud. I mean, I gotta get all scientific and climactic on you guys, you know what I mean? Even the meteorite, I'm sure like there was some kind of geological depth to that shit. It looked fucking epic as hell. The episode was beyond fucking perfect. The music, whoo, 10 out of 10, 10, 10. I mean, we got a new old OST, on the original soundtrack, which appeared to be Mano's theme song, which was epic as hell. And the ghetto Mano's Mazo statue, that was just perfect. The soundtrack was, um, was just simply magnificent. The drum beat, oh, everything was great. The pacing of the episode, way good, very good. 10 out of 10, 10, 10, 10, hello, 10, 10. Where you at, 10, 10, girl? The character development, fucking 10, 10, perfect 10, 10. I mean, did you see the synthesis of the combining combination of the attacks that the ninjas did? I mean, the wild style jutsus, especially how Oniki lighting Gara's sand, never before seen shit. You know, this show was, this show was great. This fuck was great. I gotta give this chapter review 100 out of 10. This is just, this shit is so great. I mean, guys, I've been up from since 7 a.m. Eastern Time, and it took me like five hours just to watch this episode. I had to snapshot all these epic pics for you guys. It was awesome doing all the editing. It was fucking fun. It's what made my year. I mean, again, guys, this is Nighting Guy Fate. I know a lot, you know, I call myself, I'm going to call myself, you know what, the best anime capture reviewer. And... The most passionate reviewer, fuck it. Fuck it. I was gonna say second to like King of Lightning, but fuck it. I'm the most fucking passionate. So please subscribe, comment, like, and even give video response to the video, guys. Until next time, sayonara.